So another even start. Purcell on the outside from Box Hill, then Mullinger from Ringwood starting to move forward in the first 50 metres of this event, and then Keely Bourne from Diamond Valley hot on the heels of Mullinger from Ringwood. They turn around from home. Keely Bourne out in front. Kiprios starting to move forward on her outside. Mullinger, but it's Keely Bourne from Diamond Valley. The Diamond Valley athlete, two flights to go. Great hurdle technique. Aaron Kiprios on the inside and Mullinger, but that's how they'll finish. Keely Bourne from Diamond Valley, 29.51 the official time. Mullinger and Kiprios, they're the top three in the final of the women's under 16 at 200 metres. So official time, 29.52, you can see it on the scoreboard. So congratulations to our finalists in the women's under 16 at 200 metres. Full field of eight for this final. On the outside, Pundich from Geelong got a great start. She's already up to Doherty. Then in the middle of lane three, Catherine Wilcock from Mentone pressuring Sophie McMahon from Western A's and Casey Perkins in the middle. Throw a blanket over them coming into the home turn. Probably in the middle, Catherine Wilcock and also Casey Perkins from Geelong and Maya Pundich from Geelong on the outside. It's the two Geelong athletes, Pundich from Geelong and Casey Perkins battling it out. It's gonna be tight, it is very tight. 30.62 unofficially between Maya Pundich and Casey Perkins from Geelong. But listen, you can't buy sportsmanship like that. The two Geelong girls embracing. Congratulations to the entire field in the under-15 women's 200-metre hurdles. We'll just wait for the official placing. 30.61, lane seven has the nod. Maya Pundich from Geelong. Casey Perkins from Geelong Guild second. So now a field of four, Craddock from Glen Huntley, Elodie Ferrali in the Old Severians colours, and Amber Clark from the Junior Development Squad, and of course on the inside, Tams, uh, sorry, Tams and Slay by the look of it. But Gemma Craddock from Glen Huntley, challenged by El Elodie Ferrali. Craddock hurdling well with three flights to go. Look at that look of determination. She heads out over the last flight. So good run from Gemma Craddock. Very close for second. Amber Clark will come over the top of Elodie Ferrali. And well done to Tamsin Slay from the Junior Development Squad. Unofficially 31.86 for the final event under the 200 metre hurdles championships. Very shortly we'll head, we'll head across to the 200 metres in the meantime.